Warrior. We have Hobbits versus Giants. <laughs> Don't worry, he looks tall because he's not a slang guy. The Hobbits are equipped with their long range weapon of the Uzi and the short range hockey stick. This is mid range. The Giants have the tennis ball thrown great distances and baseball bats. Good armor, too. And armor. Okay, first we'll show <laughs> the hobbits. And over here we have our boogie board test dummy. Wait, guys, are you going to shoot me with the Uzi? Where we will test the damage of the weapons. Wait, guys, are you going to shoot me with... Okay, let's see the damage done, guys. <laughs> Alright. And let's check out the map. Look at that impact. It's like a slicing damage. one. No, dude. He shot those three. <laughs> oh, see here? This would be a definite bruiser. That one, I want to say more of a of a, wel a welter. You know, that would definitely give this one up here. Right here, see that one? That, that one's a kill shot for sure. Right there in the upper torso. Neck for a hobbit. Yeah. Chin for a giant. Definite death. <laughs> there's there's one. giant's turn. Look out, look out. And here's the giant. Two, two tennis balls, Nate. Go. <laughs> then pick it back up. Oh look at that form. Go get it. Oh, but, <laughs> <laughs> but the inaccuracy may serve as an advantage for the hobbit. Like reloading skills. <laughs> <laughs> Miss. <laughs> Miss. <laughs> oh! Movement on the target. Hold on, one more guy, one more. <laughs> he got four shots too. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. And as you can see by the one hit <laughs> by the general movement of the board that would be a definite bruiser slash knocker outer concussion or for, for this guy here since he was the ball hit right around here that would be a definite headshot for this little little itty bitty hobbit hairy feet yeah. <laughs> okay go get your tennis oh he did and now we are moving to the short range weapons where the giant will be testing his baseball bat on this heavy duty plastic trash can. You can also buy this at Sports Hill. Okay. That tape job gives him extra grip so he will not lose his aim. Also Hopefully. Or else the camera's getting knocked out. Go. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> you guys know that has grass in it. <laughs> yeah, well there's okay. grass on the lawn too, midget. <laughs> Shouldn't it be your head? I'm gonna shred you! Guys, <laughs> go. As you can see, by this trash can was knocked several feet. That would be a definite breaking of the collarbone area to the neck and the throat. And then after that, he went in with a couple extra strikes, which, depending on which way, which way he landed, that could have been a face shot or the back of the head which could pretty much kill him. <laughs> and now for the short range weapon of the Hobbit, the infamous hockey stick. That tape drop almost also adds extra grip. No strength. 
And now for the damage. As you can see, there are multiple scratches, some of which were made previously by the giant, but still. <laughs> these these could be definite, definite same, basically same thing, a little bit less strength, so maybe, maybe not a full break, but more of a fracture. And then I think with those couple extra strikes, he could still kill him. So there's definite possibility for both sides here. Okay. And now for the armor test. For the Hobbit, the basic baseball catcher's chest guard. And testing it will be the giant with the tennis ball and his close range baseball bat. Oh, there is that inaccuracy again. Neat. Just hit it. <laughs> As you can see, the tennis ball's inaccuracy has not even grazed the chest guard, so we really have no data supporting the protection of that against the, te the, against the tennis ball. But as you saw, the baseball bat can still serve some catastrophic damage. And now we test the Uzi and the hockey stick against the shin guards and the baseball helmet. As you can see, the slowness of the reloading can, could very well affect the deadliness of this weapon. Alright, switch to... Uh... Wait. As you saw from the carnage of the armor, the hockey stick serves as a very nice weapon. But as you can see, the BBs from the Uzi, no damage at all. So now we move on to the actual fighting round. <laughs> 